morning. It's about nine o'clock. Gonna head over to Seattle. It's gonna be a long drive. First come in, it's actually really dark. Also, since I'm gonna be here all three days for day one, I'm just gonna be all casual, nothing else. Suited up today was casual, so I'll see you guys tomorrow. Morning, it's day two, time to suit up. means I don't have to do a bunch of shit that I might not really want to do, you know what I mean? Which has been an, um, the first time in my career that I felt able to do that, because I knew another Marvel movie would come in, right? So that's been, that has also been amazing and really freeing as, a, as an artist to not have to go and make a move that you might, you know, have to make, you know, because you got to pay the mortgage, whatever, you right? know? And it also occurs to me, just in looking at you, I respond. There could be a world where you can move about freely and children don't necessarily go, oh my god, it's the vision, whereas you walk out and kids must be like, oh my god, it's Scarlet Witch, because you look like you. You know, I think... With the exception of the ball cap. I don't have... I, don't, I get the only, like, the nicest people coming up to me, um, if it's at the grocery store or running errands in L.A., and I'm 
I'm, I never feel like uncomfortable. It's always just the sweetest, nicest people just saying, I love your movies. Yeah, they like run away, you know? Like they don't, <laughs> they don't want to bother you, but they want to say something. And I actually really appreciate that, that exchange. I think what gets the, the odd part is when you have like men follow you because they want to like sell your picture. And then you're like, why are you following me home, sir? Right. Um, don't you know what I could do? I actually pulled over one day and got out of my car and walked towards his car. I was so frustrated and he drove away. <laughs> Pretty awesome. And I was like, oh, I should do that every time. <laughs> I'd be pissed scared at, like if she's coming, where are the rest of the Avengers? Like, <laughs> I'm trying to be serious, but you can tell that I was trying to like hold back a smile. Uh, Tom was a really nice guy. He said hi, I like my jacket. And uh, Tom's like, like super empty. So I'm gonna take a few more photos, then I'm gonna head home, get ready for day three. All right, I'm back in the hotel. And like to add on to what I said last part, uh, I wanted to do the whole Mr. Stark, I don't, I don't feel so good. I don't want to go like that part where he died at the end, but since he was running late and he had to go into a thing and a uh, talk in like five, no, not five minutes, that's ridiculous, like 20 minutes and he was already running late, so I kind of just like, hey, how you doing? And wait, you start earlier. Overall, it's been a lot of fun, but like the convention thing itself is a lot smaller than what I'm used to. Like, I'm used to a lot of bigger things. And then you just walk from one end to the next, and like five minutes, so there's a small amount of people. So, yeah. Uh, I'll just see you guys in the morning, and I'm gonna suit up in my black suit tomorrow, and I'm actually gonna go into overtime with the whole photo op thing and get a picture with Sebastian Stan and Anthony Mackie, like the photo op together thing. Now, to make up for the fact that I didn't get a picture with them, Wizard World and like Anthony Mackie is a cool guy. So, see you guys tomorrow. All right, here at day three, and uh, let's just let's end this.
day three is a wrap. Just got my photo up, as you saw earlier. And yeah, it's just time to head home. I'm back home, so uh, you know this part from the last con I went to, just stuff I got there. Uh, I got a 2099 Funko Pop. Uh, I got a little print art. Uh, the Amazing Spider Man issue 252, I think. Uh, just like his first appearance in the black suit, which was cool. The entire Spider Verse. A uh, story in one complete book. And you already saw these. Me, Tom Holland. Me, Anthony Mackie, and Sebastian Stan. And now, we the big part. Bubba Fett slippers. I'm gonna say this is a belt. I think this is a belt. Yeah. Looks like another lanyard. Star Wars texting gloves, which is actually good. They're for texting. Uh, a little Stormtrooper hat. But since it's the middle of summer, it's kind of useless. Uh, Aw, little I love you, I know bracelets. If only I had someone to share these with. Yeah. Mandalorian necklace. And a pin, I want to say, of a U-wing. Or it's a keychain. And the last thing. Styrofoam. Not a fan of this stuff. Oh, it's a Darth Vader mug. Nice. So yeah, that was everything. Thanks all for watching, and I'll see you guys later.